here we are at the mad scientist lab behind me. You can see the uh, 41 mile per gallon turbo Nissan 240SX. That's right. For those of you who don't believe it, I don't care. Yes, she's dirty. She's a daily driver. I drive her every day. And of course, the big dirty Pathfinder. Now, it's all filthy. Hasn't been washed. But that's okay, because that's not what I'm here to show you today. Today we have something special. This is a Rocketta MC 54250B. Basically, it's a Chinese 250cc scooter. If you're familiar with Chinese scooters, you'll see that that's a very lovely one in very good shape. Now, I've had this bike on the road for almost a year now, and it's been well broken in. It's a very zippy vehicle, but one thing that you've never seen on one of these bikes is the fact that it's a hydrogen hybrid. Hydrohybrids.net is proud to present the world's first commercially available hydrogen system available for scooters. Now this is a prototype system. This system has been on this vehicle for 3,000 miles, just about 3,000 miles, 100 miles less. We've done tests on 50cc scooters, 150cc scooters. This is, like I said, a 250cc scooter. If anybody uh, is a scooter geek, this is a Lin High clone. It's actually a 257cc. Gets up and goes just fine. So why do we put hydrogen on it? Well, the reason we put hydrogen on it is because we want to upgrade the performance. We want to go faster. We want to get a few more miles per hour. Now, everybody that has a scooter wants to get a few more miles per hour. Don't you want to get a few more miles per hour? Now, typically, people use these for uh, vehicles to get better gas mileage, just like you see there on the side of that Pathfinder. But this, screw gas mileage. This thing already gets about 70 miles a gallon. Now, we put the hydrogen system on there, and the hydrogen puts out a perfectly stoic mixture of hydrogen and oxygen. Now you say, what does that mean to me? Well, that means you get the kit, you put it on your scooter, you don't have to mess with adjusting air fuel ratios, you don't have to rejet your carburetor, you don't have to mess around with any of that stuff. If you've been looking at, at, at scooter performance parts, you've probably noticed it. You know, MRP Speed and a lot of these guys, they've got a lot of great stuff for your scooter. But if you don't have five, six hundred dollars to spend on the whole kit and caboodle, what you going to do to get a little bit more pep, get a little bit more go? I tell you, how you get a little bit more go? You get more go with Hydro. Now give me just a minute. We're going to turn this on. Crank there. Just so you guys can see, mileage right there. Almost 5,000 miles on this bike, running great. Runs like a rocket. With the hydrogen system on here, or on any scooter, you'll start to feel more power. You're going to have better acceleration. Going up hills, you're going to have a whole lot more power going up hills. Now let's take a look down here, and you can see the container absolutely fills with bubbles pouring off the electrode. Right? Now, you know, there's a lot of people who have messed around with hydrogen. If you mess around with hydrogen, you think you can build one of these for yourself. That's fine. Uh, we have a complete kit available that doesn't have any guesswork. You don't have to worry about any of the, the risks of uh, experimenting yourself. Because we've taken all the guesswork out of it. We've made all the mistakes. Uh, screwed up everything you can screw up. And we know exactly what you need to do to put this stuff there in and not have any problems. Now, when you're looking at that, you're like, well, that's just a strange looking crap. But all of that gas that you see, all that swirl and cloud in there that you see, I pouring off those electrons, hydrogen oxygen, in a perfectly stoic mix. So you don't have to screw with anything. You just put the kit in. You crank it up. You're going to notice that your bike's a little quieter. You're going to notice that your exhaust smell is going to smell a lot less like gas. Because this kit 
will make your scooter more green and more earth friendly. Now, the fun stuff is the fact that when you take off at the light, you're going to have a lot more get up and go. When you're going up a hill and you got a passenger on the back of your scooter, you're going to be able to get up that hill and maintain speed a lot better than had you just been messing around on a stock scooter. Now, you don't have to modify your exhaust. Other than this system, this scooter is perfectly stock. There is absolutely no clutch modifications done. There's absolutely no air intake modifications done. I don't have an exhaust. This is just a stock Rocketta MC54 250B running hydrogen. Another great thing about the hydrogen Another great thing about the hydrogen is with these small engines, they tend to run really hot. Well, any time you combust hydrogen in an internal combustion engine, you actually end up with a cooler combustion temperature. And what that means is that your hot little engine, while working a little bit harder, is actually going to run just a little bit cooler because of the cooler combustion. Hydrogen combusts more completely. The fuel inside every Every cylinder, every time it fills with gasoline, it's going to burn more completely. You're going to get more bang, and it's going to be more cool. There's less exhaust bypass gases. There's less unused gases coming out of the exhaust right here. And like I said, you can get down here by the exhaust. And I'm smelling the exhaust, and it, and it, and it almost smells like, almost smells like seawater. Because there's a lot of hydrogen going into that engine. Now, this isn't for miles per gallon. This is just so you can have more get up and go. So, if you're curious, you want to get more hydrogen, you want to get more scooter performance. Sorry about that flub up. I'm not even going to edit that out. You want to get more go, drop by scooters.hydrohybrids.net and check out the kit. It's a real affordable kit. Everybody can afford it. If you can use a screwdriver and you can use a drill, you'll have this kit installed and 30, 45 minutes, maybe an hour, depending on how hard to get your body panels off it is. You know, it varies from scooter to scooter. But anyway, you're looking at the world's first 250cc hydrogen hybrid scooter. This is a daily driver. I drive the dog crap out of this vehicle. You can have reliable performance increases too without having to sacrifice mileage, without having to sacrifice longevity. So drop by scooters.hydrohybrid.net.